Pennsylvania. Motorcycle practice test. Question 1 Which of the following is a factor in your blood alcohol level? A. The type of alcohol. B. The time of day. C. The location in which you are drinking. D. How fast you drink. Answer D. How fast you drink is a factor in your blood alcohol level. Question 2. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is A. On freeways B. In school zones C. At intersections D. On rural roads Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things and may not see the motorcycle. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center of the lane position. Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center of the lane position. Question 5. If your front tire fails while riding, you should ease off the throttle and A. Use both brakes and stop on the shoulder of the road. B. Use the rear brake and move to the side of the road. C. Use the front brake and move to the side of the road. D. Pull the kill engine switch and roll to a stop. Answer C. 
A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things and may not see the motorcycle. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things and may not see the motorcycle. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center of the lane position. Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center of the lane position. Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger.
Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center of the lane position. Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center of the lane position. Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger.
Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center of the lane position. Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center. Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger.
Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center of the lane position. Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center of the lane position.
Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center of the lane position. Answer C. You should ride slower when carrying a passenger. Question 5. If your front tire fails while riding, you should ease off the throttle and. Question 3. When riding with a passenger, how should you adjust your control of the motorcycle? A. Ride faster. B. Only ride in the left of the lane position. C. Ride slower. D. Only ride in the center of the lane position.
Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things and may not see the motorcycle. Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things and may not see the motorcycle. Answer A. When carrying cargo or a passenger, an increased stopping distance is required. Adjust your writing accordingly. Question 36. You should not ride your motorcycle alongside of cars because A. The car driver cannot make a turn. B. Your bike may skid. C. You could be in a blind spot. D. None of the above. Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things. Answer A, when carrying cargo or a passenger, an increased stopping distance is required. Question 36. You should not ride your motorcycle alongside of cars because A. The car driver cannot make a turn. B. Your bike may skid. C. You could be in a blind spot. D. None of the above. Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things and may not see the motorcycle.
Answer A. When carrying cargo or a passenger, an increased stopping distance is required. Adjust your writing accordingly. Question 36. You should not ride your motorcycle alongside of cars because A. Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things and may not see the motorcycle. Answer A. When carrying cargo or a passenger, an increased stopping distance is required. Adjust your writing accordingly. Question 36. You should not ride your motorcycle alongside of cars because A. The car driver cannot make a turn. B. Your bike may skid. C. You could be in a blind spot. D. None of the above. Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different Answer A. When carrying cargo or a passenger, an increased stopping distance is required. Question 36. You should not ride your motorcycle alongside of cars because A. The car driver cannot Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things and may not see the motorcycle. Answer A. When carrying cargo or a passenger, an increased stopping distance is required. Adjust your writing accordingly. Question 36. You should not ride your motorcycle alongside of cars because A. Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things and may not see the motorcycle.
Answer A. When carrying cargo or a passenger, an increased stopping distance is required. Adjust your writing accordingly. Question 36. You should not ride your motorcycle alongside of cars because A. The car driver cannot make a turn. B. Your bike may skid. C. You could be in a blind spot. D. None of the above. Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things. Answer A, when carrying cargo or a passenger, an increased stopping distance is required. Question 36. You should not ride your motorcycle alongside of cars because A. The car driver cannot make a turn. B. Your bike. Answer C, a hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things and may not see the motorcycle. Answer A, when carrying cargo or a passenger, an increased stopping distance is required. Adjust your writing accordingly. Question 36. You should not ride your motorcycle alongside of cars because A. Answer C. A hazardous place for motorcycles to travel is at intersections because many cars are doing different things and may not see the motorcycle. Answer A, when carrying cargo or a passenger, 
an increased stopping distance is required. Adjust your writing accordingly.